Hello friends, welcome to my channel. So I'm there with another video. Friends, I made a inventory management format and I call it inventory management Y1. Y1 because you can use this format for one year continuously and after that also you can make a copy of this format and continue use it for lifetime. So I'll show you how does this format works. This is simple Excel based format. So you can use it online also like you can keep it on, on google drive or cloud anywhere and you can share it with multiple peoples also, as well as you can use this format on your smartphone if you are enough good in excel so this page is fully automatic nothing you have to do so there we have the monthly basis consumption report this is the grab box and below item consumption report so this will be the item based consumption report will show for each and every item on monthly basis like what like the onion uh, on june what is the consumption and end of the year what is the total consumption of onions or each and every items second we have item master this is the main page where you have to add the data so here we have material name or item name category brand size or trigger value serial number will be automatically update because as you can see i have already add some formula so you can use this format for multi-purpose maybe you have a restaurants or cafe or maybe you are running a mobile shop clothes shops any kind of shops or business you can use this format because as you can see first i have add here onion category is vegetable brand is local vegetables has no size so no need to mention and the trigger level that means what is the minimum quantity you have to be there or this is the reminder of your minimum level here in number phone as you can see i have add on item called jks1 is the category is t-shirt brand is jockey size is medium and trigger value that means minimum stock reminder is five so i keep here uh, total one two three four five items of jockey t-shirts and uh, different t-shirt has different name and different sizes so you can use it for clothes shop also even i keep at number three mi note 5 pro it's a mobile categories mobile phone brand is mi there is no size and trigger level is five so that's how you have to add the item details that's all right side this data will be fully automatic as you can see i have already mentioned inventory data fully automatic when you done this place then we have the month's name like january february march till december so every sheet has same format so first there we have the company name so you have to change the company name in january month whatever the company name you have and rest of the sheets the company name will be changed automatically and as you can see all the item name that i have saved here in item master the, all the name will be automatically added in every sheet till december so this format is 80 90 percent fully automatic and the 8 20 or 10 percent the things that you have to do manually is you have to add the quantity of the ingredients that can be in or out that's all so i'll show you how we have to do it so first we are in january month and i'll show you for example onion we have received like 10 kgs and out is 5 kg so i have simply added as you can see the running balance is 5 now because or we have received onion 10 kgs but we have sell 5 kgs similar way i can add the mi note 5 pro like we have received 10 and we have uh, sold out or transferred somewhere like that will be out from our stock so quantity is 3 you will see the total section is here and total inward and outward stock also for each item will be fully update at this place and the balance quantity also you can see from here so every sheet has same format and also as you can see uh, when i select mi note 5 pro the trigger level is 5 when we have already 7 that means it's not showing order rest of the item is showing order because the quantity of or running balance is zero as i select here uh, or i set here the trigger level two so you don't change the trigger level from here or you don't touch this 
part of the data because uh, everywhere there is a formula or if one single formula will be delete this format will stop working so uh, this is the day one day two day three day four and till the end of 31 because we are on january month so that's how if we uh, open february we'll see from 1 to 28 till here we can enter the data so till december we have the same format similar way it will work and as i already mentioned this is the simple excel file but fully automatic 80 90 percent fully automatic only you have to add the data in item master and then you have to enter the amount that is coming inward or outward in your store so automatically rest of the things will work and i show you in graph see january we have a uh, 20 in and 8 per percent or quantity you can say like outward going uh, february there is no entry yet so in february i'll add some data and i'll show you february also let's uh, take some jockey t-shirts like 10 2 and outward will be 2 and then 2 now when i come home page you will see the graph automatically uh, start showing like 12 is in and 8 pieces or whatever the count whatever the store you have according to that you can use that graph and below the item consumption report also we can see like in january month we have uh, onion consumption 5 that can be kg or if you have uh, clothes shops then it will be count as pieces like uh, three pieces of mi note 5 pro is consumption or sell for our from our store uh, below we have the jockey also so february months jockey has two to four sales so it starts showing here also so that's how this format works this format is fully automatic uh, simple to use and uh, some of the information that i would like to give you again like when you change the name of the company in month of january rest of the pages the company name will be changed automatically even you have to add the opening a stock manually like when you purchase this format maybe you have some already stock or uh, some items already have in your stock so you're not going to add them in inward so instead of that you can use in opening a stock and after that you can enter the data according to the date in that can be inward or outward no problem but in january month only this place you can add the opening a stock if i go to the february and in february if i click here you can see there is a formula so don't edit or delete anything uh you see i mark here till red from b to j so don't edit any of the cell this places or the formula will stop working so i show you that uh, the way this format works is really good and really useful for a lot of people so if you want to download this format the link will be in the description box thank you very much for watching this video